Hello, welcome back to my channel. Sorry I haven't posted a video in quite some time. Right, so, here's the situation. Bit of a boo-boo on my part, big boo-boo. What I've managed to do, I was doing a, uh, a job at work and uh, repairing a NAS box uh, for which I needed to solder in a resistor and this little solder tip wasn't, uh, wasn't quite heating up what I needed hot enough. So I tried to actually undo do it. Oh, I did turn this off, but this was obviously still hot. And I tried to take this bit out uh, and replace it with a bigger bit. But unfortunately, specifically that bit, uh, unfortunately though, what happened was uh, it just broke off. So now I have in there the remnants of the bit. So what I've gone and done is I have bought a screw extractor set. Not that exciting, but it has left-handed drill bits. Uh, and it's quite likely, given that the bit is copper, that it will end up gripping the bit enough to take it out without actually having to use a screw extractor. So what we're going to do is stick it in the vise. Is that too much? Where did I put that piece of paper? I'm just there. We go. Right. Wrap this around to uh, protect it from the vice jaws. Doesn't need to be that hard, hardly gripped. And that will do for the protection. There we go. Just turn that. So now, the bit I'm going to start with is considerably larger than I need, but the reason for doing that is because what I want to do is use it to start the hole off, and then turn the drill backwards, hold on, let me just make sure. Yeah, that is Kang, and we are going to go try and mark a centre with this. We have got a nice convincing centre. There we go. Now I can go down to quite a small, actually I'm not going to go down the smallest drill, I can. I'm going to go down to that drill, which it says here is a 760 fourths. I can get it. So she drove right the way through it. Crikey. Let me try. And hook that out then. Do that one. And a pair of pliers on that. No, I'm going to need a tap holder on that. Right, let me just get a tap holder.
What I don't want to do is turn this so hard I break something. That is actually. I'll just go and put a mark on this. Let's just to make sure that's not turning because I might just have to get a tap out and run a cleaning tap down it. No? Okay, so that's now turning that. So that's part of the problem, that copper is too sticky. So let me just see if I can work out. Some thread that is. Right, it looks like an M3. I'll just reset that for M3 then. Or does it? Might actually be an M4. Unless I've managed to just drill the whole thing out. <laughs> Do you know what? That looks like a perfectly formed thread. So the drill size I picked went straight down the copper and didn't touch the sides. Let's see if that does screw in. Ah, no it doesn't. Right, so it's got to be M4. So if I go up the side, that will clean it up. Hopefully it will. Okay, what it's doing is it is cleaning it out a bit. I'll just put up those plugs. Still got some copper. From the bit visible at the bottom. Let me just try that tap. And now trying the closest thing I've got to a plug tap in that size. It's 
copper is quite sticky so I'm having to back it off quite a lot. That's it. Those look good. Screws right in there. So now I'm going to take that out. Shake all the dust out. See if it melts solder. Right. I shall be back when it's warmed up. Hopefully that's hot enough now. Yes it is. There we go. Right. Fix my boo boo. Thank you for watching. Please like, please share, please subscribe. Didn't work out anything like I thought it was going to do. I thought I was going to drill in a bit, and as I drilled in, it would extract it. That didn't happen. I thought, well, okay, um, I could put a screw extractor in. That wasn't going to work because it's, the copper was too sticky. In the end, I re tapped the hole. Um, the M3 tap cleaned it a bit, but it's clearly not an M3 hole. I, should have seen if I could put my hands on and now I can see where it is on my um, digital calipers. I'd have worked out that was an M4, I just run an M4 tap down it. Anyway, all done. Thank you for watching. Don't forget, please like, please share, please subscribe. Comments or positive, useful comments, welcome. 